hello everyone and i'm back with another video where i will be reviewing the renault duster now this renault duster is the car which started the mid size suv craze now like always let's talk about the variants and the color variants starting from the variants of the renault duster the variants of this car are rx e rx s and the completely top variant rx z i am reviewing the rx z white mahangi brown grey dark grey orange blue and bronze are the color options of the car talking about the price this car is priced around 9.9 and lakhs let's start the walk around starting from the front you get to see full chrome grill with a huge reno badging at the middle and the chrome design is something like this which is given below and beside the full chrome grill you get to see projector setup with led drl now these are waterfall led drls and there's a reno badging inside and guys below the projector headlamps you get to see round shaped fog lamp with a chrome insert above which makes the car more sportier and there uh, and there's a dual tone bumper and also guys this dual tone bumper looks great on this car and guys this is the front profile this car looks okay type for me it's my opinion you may like it or you may not and guys uh talking about the dimensions of this car the dimension of this car in length is 4360 width is 1822 height is 1695 and guys this is bigger than the hyundai creta in dimensions and when you come to the side you notice there are 16 inch 21565 diamond cut alloys and this is the rxz badging this is the body colored orvm with a halogen turn indicator and guys this is the old style body color door handles there should have been chrome but you don't get chrome this is the rear door handle and the windows are quite huge there's a charging socket on the parcel tray and guys talking about the build quality of this car this car is really powerful and guys talking about the super structure of this car this car's quality is very good guys so in build quality it's a good car and guys this is the side profile of the car the side profile looks quite boxy and when you look up you notice there are two huge roof rails with a duster badging on it and this huge roof rails make the car more like an suv and the power of this car is 5600 rpm and guys this is the rear profile of the car the rear profile looks quite muscular this is the rear tail lamps the led shape is something like this other solar halogen halogen indicator and a reverse lamp this is the reno badging duster badging is over here and there's a reno badging also this is the rear wiper the spoiler is missing guys and there is a stop lamp with a washer when you look down you you notice that there are again dual tone bumpers with a chrome finish on the exhaust and the reflectors are standard in all variants and there are total 3 parking sensors on this car not 4 parking sensors which are disappointing you only get 3 parking sensors and guys this is the boot of the car 475 liters of boot space this is a massive size boot and this is the luggage lamp and guys you get a tool kit over there there is a storage space over here parcel tray now guys 
talking about the engine this car has a 1.5 engine which produces 1498 cc and the maximum cylinders are four cylinder open the door of the renault duster you notice that there are fabric finish with blue stitching this is the interior door handle there are some storage space with a window control but there is no bottle holder and storage space below you get a speaker these are the fabric seats guys and guys once you sit inside the duster you notice you are very comfortable these seats are more comfortable than they look and guys there is a magazine holder over here which cannot be opened right now there are two headrests at the front and guys there is no armrest in this car but you get a huge cup holder or you could say bottle holder and there is a center headrest which is fixed headrest other two headrests are adjustable and this is the armrest to keep the rear passengers comfortable i don't know why are the two lights divided now guys you get a nice headroom but decent legroom and guys let's go to the front open the front door of the dust you just notice there is a handle given and now you get at the front doors bottle holders with storage space and guys so let's sit inside the renault duster and let's check out so here i am sitting inside the car it's quite comfortable and this is the glove box with a light guys the glove box is quite spacious the quality of glove box is better than the harrier and this is the srs badging there is an ac vent with chrome insert there is another ac vent to the chrome insert talking about the safety this car has two airbags not six airbags which is quite disappointing here you get to see piano black finish and this is the 9 inch touch screen of the car automatic climate control there are a few buttons over here cup holders five speed manual transmission not six speed and guys this is the handbrake of the car which a, which has a chrome insert above this is the steering wheels there are also audio controls mounted srs airbag badging over here this is the instrument cluster and here you can browse things this is the irvms not auto dimming this is the sunshade with a vanity mirror and this is the light this is the driver sunshade no vanity mirror and guys when you open the doors of the car the touch screen shows you the time and guys these are fake buttons not real and there is another glove box up it's not that big you could keep your mobile phone wallet or at least three cans inside the upper glove box and guys this is the driver seat the driver would be driving the duster comfortably now this is the driver seat door orvms control window control one touch up and down windows for the driver this is the where you start the engine no engine start stop button this is the wiper control volume control this is the thing to recline the seat the headrests are a bit small guys i think what do you think tell in the comment section and guys so that was the review of the renault duster tell me in the comment section if you like this car or not and 
I'll meet you in my next video. Subscribe to my channel, like the video, and don't forget to share it.